Good morning, you're with Simon today and I'm starting a new series of videos looking at all the nine hole golf courses in my area. The sort of places that you would normally overlook. And these little golf courses, they are a real test of your self-discipline, your course management, and a spider hanging off my hat. So here we are, the very first course. This course costs £12.50 for 18 holes, but at the moment they're doing a lockdown special to get us all out on the golf course of £8. So where am I? Well, welcome to Dimmock Grange Golf Club. I'll try and do this without getting run over by a car. In fact, here comes a car. So, we'll see you on the first tee. Welcome to Dimmock Grange. First hole, an easy par 5, I'm sure you will agree, until you see the second shot over these oak trees. I've just gouged out a 9 to get over the top out of this rough. Left myself about 50. There's no irrigation here, so the greens are a little firm. They're watering them with a bowser. Well, I missed the bird, but I'll show you what they've done with the cup here. And I think I prefer this to what they've done at our place, if I'm honest. Let me show what they've got in the cup here. Because everyone's doing different things. Number two. Wind is off the left, and that big tree down the left is a little bit intimidating. Basher absolutely nuts one. Shot. Number three, got to hit a little draw here with the wind off the left and that tree and both of us let it go. As you've probably spotted, we're doing a hole each on the video, but Basher just can't help himself busting in on my hole.
Right, number four. It's not very long, but you can't see anything from the T. We weren't too sure what to go with here, so we both went with a hybrid. Straight at it. Well, as you can see, during lockdown, they haven't done a lot of green keeping. So the fairways are quite thick, which is making contact with the ball rather difficult. But for eight quid, who's complaining? We had a laugh anyway. In fact, we were rolling with some of the putts. Never miss so many putts. Fun and games. Number five, a short par three over two ponds. Basher had just drowned one before me, so uh, I wasn't exactly brimful of confidence over this shot. I dunked it into uh, that front bunker, for which I got a drop out of, because they're all out of play, as you can see. And then I proceeded to cover myself in glory, or rather something browner with the putting. Number six, you're supposed to score a drop goal between the two big trees in the distance, but uh, Basha decides to take an alternative route. Number seven. Now I was looking for a high cut here. Unfortunately, I got a low pull. The rest is history. Well, this is the correct entrance to the green. Uh, Basher's just knifed one through the back into the water. The green's surrounded on three sides by water. Does anybody here still think that little nine hole courses are easy? Because this one isn't. This is a real challenge. Think it would be easier when it's soft and green, but not at the moment. Number eight, and the second par five. You've got to drive the ball over the top of that oak tree. I just managed it, but Basher just put one into orbit. This was huge. Wow, that's huge. Well, I've just hit my second shot through the tree. If there's anyone with enough power to get over the top of these two oak trees, it's your man Basher. Shot. He's left himself about 50 yards here. Flags up on the back shelf where my ball is already. Let's see if you can join me. Stop. 
I try to bust in on the party here and get my birdie. Alas, I do not. Will Basher get his? Ninth and final hole. Tee shot requires a draw around the tree. I managed to hit the other type of draw, which is a bit of a slicey fade. And I'm going to finish with rather a large number on this hole. Such is life. Can't be helped. Well, that's it. That's the nine holes done. Bit of a dip there. We are back to the mansion house. Just got the the task of three putting this to uh, finish out the nine. What a lovely little course. And many, many interesting holes. I mean, you step on that first and you think, oh, 420 yard par five, that's a piece of cake. Until you get to your ball and you look what you got for your second shot. I'm about 25 30 feet short here. So, thanks for watching. Got another nine hole course coming up next. See you on the next video. Ta ra! Mm -hmm.